Hello kids, hope you're fine. My name is Nishtha ma'am. I'm Rima Desai. Today I'm going to show you some activity that you can do at your home with minimum things. So let's start. Uh, your first activity is transferring water from one bottle to another through this funnel. In this activity, you need two plastic bottle and one funnel. Okay, one bottle should be full of water and other should be empty. Now you have to put funnel on the empty bottle and slowly, slowly. You have to pour water into another water. The activity with water is always fun for children. So slowly you can transfer the whole water. This way you can transfer the complete water bottle to another bottle. This activity helps to increase your child concentration level. So for combing you require a comb and a clip. So for combing I'm going to make two partitions. I'm going to gently comb my hair. See, I'll, be I'll be making partitions and then I will detangle all the knots. And I'm going to gently comb my hair. So this is how you de this is how we detangle all your knots and your combing is done so I'm going to tie up my hair now take a small clip and tie it in your hair and it's done The next activity is a painting activity. Uh, we call it a wet water painting. In this activity, uh, you need one white thin paper. You can use a printer paper, uh, one vessel. In this, you need uh, one broad uh, vessel. In this, you need some water. Few your favorite colors. Here, I am taking blue, red, yellow and green. And few brushes. Okay, let's start this activity. First, you have to pass this white paper through this water slowly. Okay, like this. Okay. Now, your paper become wet. Okay, now, I'm putting this out. Okay. What you have to do, you have to take one brush and put a big drop here. Okay. Now take another color and put big drop here. Okay. Then same way you can apply different colors. Here I am taking yellow color. And last is green. Okay. Now you can see four different colors like this. Now with the broad brush you can spread this color like this. Painting is always fun for children, so they enjoy the different ways of painting. Okay, see. 
because of wet water you can see this image Finally, you can get this kind of image. So, this is the complete wet water painting. Thank you. For skippings, you, you require skippings. Now, we'll start with the skippings. So, for that, I'm going to use the jump rope. And before we start, it's very important to measure rope from both sides. Here it is, and we're ready to go. See, this is how it is done. I hope you practice this at your home. Bye bye.